Hi, my name's Dave. I'm the Director of Animal Care and Conservation for Odyssey Aquarium. And right now we're standing in our beautiful gallery called the Rivers of the World. Well, most of this gallery is freshwater fishes from all over the world. Uh, right now we're in our American section. We actually have Amazon animals as well as Asian animals. And these are just the freshwater rivers that are found, representatives from the freshwater rivers found all around the world. Our exhibit behind us is a, is a very special exhibit because we have a partnership with the Arizona Fish and Game. And uh, with them, we're displaying uh, species that are native to Arizona that are threatened. One of the species you see is the Apache trout, which is the state fish of Arizona. These Apache trout are found in rivers throughout Arizona. The problem is the numbers, they're being decimated. So we need to make sure that we keep these these numbers high and keep the species alive for generations to come in this state. Well, these animals are endangered for numbers of reasons. First of all, habitat destruction, runoff from farms, just having overfishing happen. So Arizona Game and Fish uh, tries to uh, manage these numbers by restocking large lakes and, and rivers each year. They also do a uh, census on these animals to keep a track of how many approximately that there are in the state, as well as they do disease management. So they'll look at all these animals, make sure they don't have anything that could be susceptible to wiping out uh, the species in the wild. The Apache trout size ranges anywhere between six to 24 inches. So the animals you see behind us are about a foot long. They're sub-adults, about a year and a half to two years old. So they'll approximately double in size uh, before they're full grown. In the wild, they're opportunistic eaters. So they'll eat everything from small bugs, types of leaves as well. The Apache trout are territorial. They like their own space. So they're constantly competing to to be in their own space and it looks like they're actually playing tag behind us but they're, they're trying to figure out what space is theirs and what's their neighbors. We have the responsibility to be a conservation partner with, with many different organizations. Being a new facility, we're building those relationships and those bonds. We're already working with Arizona Game and Fish. We also have a relationship with a, a African penguin organization in South Africa that we support. And we will continue looking for ways both locally, nationally, and internationally to aid into the conservation efforts.